She goes that Tony Nadi has been residing in South Africa for 15 years now. He moved to this neighborhood eight years ago. This area is one of the diverse areas in the country's economic hub, Gauteng. Since Nadi moved here, he and his neighbors have maintained good neighborly relations. In my neighborhood, there's no problem. Sometimes outside there, when I go out my business, I get a bit worried what's going to happen to me because always I'm not going to be in my neighborhood all the times. Me and Tony and the rest of the family, we get along. We are in good terms. I can even leave my house keys with them if I go somewhere. They switch on the lights for me for the safety of my house. Even with them, if they go away, I take care of their house. I tell them to inform me so that I can look after their home. The two neighbors are aware of the recent xenophobic attacks on foreign nationals. Last month, immigrants' homes and businesses, including those belonging to Nigerians, were looted and torched in suburbs of Johannesburg and Pretoria, the capital city, raising concerns about anti-foreigner sentiment in the country. But Nadi is not worried. I'm comfortable. I don't have any problem because sometimes whenever they hear about anything xenophobia, they phone me and ask me on my way, what can they do for me? Sometimes they call police vans to make sure that everything went all right. Honestly speaking? Honestly speaking, I had that thing at first, that foreigners are here to take our jobs. Until I got to know Tony and got to understand people from outside our country. At first, I had that thing that they're here to do bad things. But ever since I knew Tony, He's not a South African. The way that I know him now, he's an incredible neighbor. But if I say he is not a good neighbor, I would be lying. Even Siwale's children know Nadi as a parental figure in the neighborhood. Anytime I need assistance, I know he's a person that I can always run to. And he will be willing to help me. And they all intend on maintaining the good relations. Yolisan Jamela CGT and Pretoria, South Africa.